Hello and welcome back. Today we're going to be doing another Carl dive. This time we're going to run point extraction as a scout. So in addition to our previous rules, I'm adding on that we have to do secondary objectives and we still can't take a beer buff. So if you aren't familiar with the concept of Carl dives, the basic premise is high level of difficulty, no HUD, no Bosco, and playing alone. So for our purposes today, I'm going to be playing Hazard 5. Here's the spec. And let's head in. So I've taken a couple of attempts at this now, and I gotta say this is a little more difficult than I expected it to be. The main thing is, not having a crosshair makes it significantly harder to play a scout. I didn't really notice this initially with the engineer, as all of his weapons were, you know, the shotgun and the breech cutter, so what need was there to aim with those? But now that I'm actually trying to pick bugs off at range, I'm finding myself having some issues. Bulk detonator instantly. No crassus, sad. Okay. So I got Mactera and Menace already on me. Going for an absolute full mobility spec with my weapons. Okay, not bad. That hurt a little bit. Just gonna spend as much time as I can kiting the enemies around the mine head, letting it thin them out for me. It's trying to hold my ground against this swarm is hopeless. Come on. One. This is requiring a lot more focus than the engineer one because every moment is a, a lot more involved gameplay wise. Just because I constantly have enemies bearing down on me. Huh. Yeah, this is gonna suck. I have bugs chomping on my heels in this one, I suppose. Should be getting close to Apocas by now. Two. Take this time to dig, and I can snag the apocas later. Got myself stuck. Gonna have to take these through this tunnel. Go ahead and scope out the hazards of this right now. Probably won't be mining any nitra. I don't see myself running out of shotgun shells, so that's really the only thing I'm worried about. I need to kill this menace at some point. He's causing me more issues than anything. 
However, at this range, it's gonna be damn near impossible to hit him. It's like he knows he's keeping me at extreme ranges. There's a strategy I can employ here, but it is risky. There we go. Should do a little bit. Yes. That hurt me a lot. Surprised they didn't kill me. The strategy is risky for two reasons. One, I'm zooming close to the bulk detonator, and two, I'm risking sm slamming myself into the ground at an incredibly high speed. Doesn't want to work with me here. Okay, new plan. Okay. That worked out. My death, and it still might be. Very nearly fell into the clutches of the bulk there. Just trying to start getting these in. Well done. Okay, secondary done. That's number three. that one. That's number four. It just hit me. Got half on shells. Yeah. Keep running. The rollers have officially overtaken this area. This is a lot less interesting than I expected it to be. Just running in circles, pretty much. Just titled this one Dangerously Cheesy. Is this how all scouts play Has 5? It'd be like this. So this will be number four now. We got number five sitting there. Just get it. Gotta get out. Okay. Still more health piled up over here. Two more. Two more unaccounted for ones, I should say. I'm gonna run into the swarm in this tunnel. Okay, here's the two I need. That was very lucky. I think I got hit by three or four slashers right there. 
So now we're going to start to encounter an issue with point extraction. Thankfully I got a good tile set for it, but I have no idea where the pod is going to land. I just have to rely on intuition and experience to figure it out. Okay. Six. You know what, Scout, you're right. I do actually think we're going to make it. I've taken about four or five tr cracks at this mission so far. And this is the best it's gone. I think I'm running Shield Link and Field Medic. Boy, is everyone going to be laughing at me? Because I showed my build using field link or field link, shield link and field medic right before I started this. Well, I guess the no perk run is right around the corner then. I plan on just continuing to add restrictions once I get all the classes, at least one Carl dive done. Okay, flying and range are my biggest threats right now. Isn't that bulk to my advantage? Okay, 18 shells. More than enough. Missed that horrifically. with the oppressor. Ow. That hurt a lot. That max terror shot probably would have killed me. Okay, we're good, we're good. I think about 20 seconds. He'll call it. Yeah, he'll call it when it gets here. Alright, turrets are out of ammo. Okay, I'm all on my own now. I was standing about high middle, so it should should land low. Hopefully. Wherever it is, I have to figure it out. There it is, okay. Plug is taking fall to you, team. Drop pod departing in T minus that was a huge blunder, but I saved it with that. Okay, well, there's your scout Carl dive. Definitely a, a lot less skillful in a way than the engineer one, but that's uh, pretty entertaining, I'll give it that. I really wish I could see my health. I'm gonna run to the pod because I had to be very low. I can't believe I landed that. So I'll go ahead and explain that a little bit before I head out. As in, whenever you're hosting the game, whenever hover clock's duration ends, so whenever you stop floating in the air, it will return your momentum to you. However, whenever you're in someone else's game, when you're a client, it will cancel it entirely. So by simply charging a shot and then canceling it, you can cancel all your momentum. But the only way to cancel momentum when you're hosting is to contact a standing surface while charging the shot. So you have to start the charge with an, while you're moving, but so you'll move slowly enough to touch the floor before it 
the charge wears off. Otherwise, you'll just resume all your momentum and hit the ground and die. So that's what I got away with right there. Because I, I double-clicked the shotgun and, like, hooked around the ceiling when I didn't mean to. And I wasn't going to have time to grapple. So I managed, very luckily, to land that trick and survive. But that is a little bit more challenging than I expected it to be, but... Definitely not as slow and methodical as Engineer, more of just a frantic run in circles, as you saw. But yeah, that was pretty fun. And next, I'll probably be doing Driller, and I'm thinking either Eggs. Yeah, probably Eggs for Driller, and then Gunner will be Salvage or Elimination. Uh, I, there's not an even amount for the classes, so I'll have to overlap at some point, but we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. So. Once again, if you like content like this or any guide content for Deep Rock Galactic, please consider dropping me a like or subscribing to the channel. Also, subscribe to Milligan. This was his idea. Thank you again, and have a good day.